I keep pressing the wrong button. I mean to switch the screen over, but I accidentally click the stop sharing because I wanted to go to this. Save up to $300. <laughs> no, not that. One Piece, or The One Piece, is an anime remake of One Piece from Wit Studio. So that same studio that's doing the Suicide Squad Isekai are doing this. Ooh. They also did the first three seasons of Attack on Titan. Wait, wait, wait. So is it is it a spin-off? Oh, it's a remake. It's oh, a remake. shit. Oh, yeah. if they cut out all of like the, the recap and shit. Yeah, so oh. here's... That's one of the big things that, like... It looks like they're starting from the beginning with the East Blue Saga. Good. That's where you should. And they, here's two of the things that they really have the potential to do with this. One, step up the animation game. While it's not bad in the original One Piece, and I don't mean to diss One Piece fans because I still do think One Piece is one of the best manga ever written, the anime is awful. You could fight me on that. <clears throat> it's way too long, which this can fix, and some of the action sequences feel like they're way too slow, which this can fix, especially if Wit Studio is doing it. I do not enjoy seeing Luffy go into the whole gum gum gatling thing and sit there with the uh, the background blurred out, and it's just kind of like a static uh, or a looped animation of like blurry fists flying. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> this no, has the potential to be really, really freaking fantastic. Yeah. What if? Look, if they cut a, all of the recap and up the animation. But this would get me into One Piece. And mm -hmm. I love, I, I re mad respect, mad respect to Oda. But it's so long. I just can't get into it. Mm -hmm. It's way too long. That's what she said. This, <laughs> uh, this, again, like they have the, they have, they have the option of trimming some of the fat, condensing things down because it takes like 50 episodes for One Piece to really start. Like, you have, like, the first act of One Piece is, like, 50, 60 episodes long, and then they finally get to the Grand Line. You can skip the Millennial Dragons arc at this point because it means nothing to the series. Um, you can cut down on a lot of the sailing time. I know there's a lot of, like, character development and stuff that happens in there that uh, Oda put in, but I feel like a lot of the time there is long, long periods of nothing in this story where not a lot happens or they're just sort of like traveling around like alabasta felt like nothing happened for the longest time because they were walking across a desert for a lot of it interesting mm -hmm. and while i'm excited for this i have to say i'm a bit frustrated that it had to be one piece that got the remake what would you have rather had Berserk. Claymore. Berserk and Claymore have been pretty much left to rot, and they are amazing pieces of fantasy manga. I just finished Claymore recently, actually. It's good. It's good. I, I wonder if there are any, like, figures of uh, um, uh, Teresa, Priscilla, and Miata. Because as far as, like, Characters. Oh, I'm sure. I'm if if it's female characters you're talking about, I'm sure there's figurines. And uh, Priscilla Nick, is mostly Nick, naked Nick. the whole time, so. Woo! <laughs> so how did the live action do so well? So how did the live action do so well? I've heard the story is much more condensed. Is the live action only off a few issues? Yeah, uh, so basically the live action, um, it, it ended up cutting a lot of, uh, there people point out how it cuts a lot uh, or, or condenses a lot of content down. So in two episodes of the live action, they cover what like 15 episodes of the anime would have done. And that is when the Straw Hats get their ship, they go to an island and they're like struggling to like afford buying a ship. And they end up earning the going Mary by uh, saving the owner of the docks there. 
anyway, they condensed that down and it felt like it and uh, cut out a lot of content. I wouldn't say they cut out filler, but they cut out stuff that wasn't necessarily needed for the story to progress. So like there's a whole fight in the anime where Luffy goes up against a hypnotist, but every time the hypnotist uses his powers, they both get hypnotized. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So they spend an entire episode with that joke. They didn't do that in the um, in the live action, which I appreciate. And I do think the live action is actually like better to get into uh, or to start than the anime. Because at least the live action will give you a taste of what One Piece is really like. Because as far as like being faithful to what the series was, the live action does a pretty good job of maintaining Oda's original message, his original story, a lot of the character development that happens, keeping their arcs intact. So that's what matters most in this. I know a lot of people say that One Piece live action is mid. I honestly think it's pretty great. Yes. This is exactly right. It is a very slow burn anime because the common joke about it is that it gets really good around episode 500. I mean, honestly, I would say it gets really good around episode 200 once they do Any's Lobby Water 7. That's where things really start to pop off for the story. But then you get to Punk Hazard and Dress Rosa, and it ends up... Um, bogging itself down with recap and being too slow and not progressing enough basically doing half episodes still though i'm upset that they're redoing one piece again because i would rather see a good adaptation of berserk the greatest manga ever written or its younger sister claymore both of which have potential to be really really freaking good anime You okay, Claymore? You want an example of strong female protagonist done right? Claymore does it right. But yeah, there are so many other anime you could update to make better than One Piece. One Piece just like it, it, hitting the end of the Land of Wano, going into the Egghead arc, the Egghead Island arc. Um, they are doing some great things with their animation already. They don't need the remake. This just seems greedy. I was gonna say it feels like I've got <clears> the <throat> image of the uh, the professional, like the Olympic swimmer guy, pouring the water on top of his head. <laughs> I think Netflix is really trying to capture the fact that One Piece is one of the. It's probably the most popular. Um, isn't it anime like, out there right now? Isn't it literally the most sold um, manga, manga out there? Yeah, yeah, it's like the most sold manga. Uh, I believe One Piece has officially outsold all of Batman um, and on a like um, regular sales basis now it outsells Marvel and DC. Which, hey, good on Oda. He put a lot of freaking effort into this series. Like, well, like I said, I'm not getting into One Piece, not because I dislike it, not because I dislike Oda. Mad props to Oda for keeping a thousand episode series running and the universe, the world building, the character running consistent the and without that. and without it's, any contradictions. Yes, it is. It is a streamlined, well, streamlined in air quotes there, streamlined story. That it's a smooth story. There's no hiccups. Yeah, minus minus you know the the recap, but like, well, that's not even his fault. That's the anime. Yeah, that's 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 because the the manga only comes up with like half an episode so they have to repeat the last uh, the last half of uh, the last chapter and then I include the next chapter mm -hmm. so that's 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 the only problem I have with One Piece is it's runtime is so long that getting into it is so hard because you look at it and it's like oh it's such a good story but it's a thousand episodes long where am I going to find all that time yeah <laughs> Literally, that's the only reason I say One Piece sucks as an anime is because it takes so much freaking time. Which is sad because, again, mm -hmm. Oda's an amazing writer. He's done Dude, really good with his Shanks, character. Right off the bat, 
he does so well with Shanks as a character because, like, he doesn't even have to tell you anything about Shanks, and you know the dude is a badass. <laughs> I love, dude, Shanks is one of, like, my favorite characters of all time. Probably, like, a top ten character for me. Hmm. Um, But I, like, even at that, like, One Piece still bugs me because I feel like for all of the good storytelling, it doesn't have enough payoff to keep me interested in the sheer amount of episodes that I have to watch. Mm -hmm. Which is why yeah. this remake would have been better going to Berserk. Because Berserk, Berserk 2016 was a disaster. We, we do will, not, will... we do not uh, accept Berserk 2016. Claymore never even got a complete anime. Which is a tragedy. And there are plenty of other series out there that could have used this kind of uh, effort. Like if they did this kind of stuff to like, say, remaking, I don't know. I, I don't want to say Naruto because Naruto is still kind of running in the form didn't of Boruto. they announced? Didn't they announce that Naruto was getting reanimated already? I don't know. I Naruto think so. I think something, so. Something about Mr. Beast making a tweet joke about like, what if I funded them reanimating Naruto? And then, like shortly after, like a cup, like a week or so after that, there was a big blow up announcement that Naruto was getting reanimated. And then I didn't hear anything about it after that. Still, though, yeah, it's a titanic amount of uh, work to get into some of these series. Even though they're good, it's hard to recommend them or to even say, like, yeah, they're like amazing top tier because of the amount of work you have to put into like catching up. If you didn't start watching it or before it got to 100 episodes, you are probably so far flipping behind. <laughs> well, like me, I know I I'm staying away from One Piece because of its length. That that's the only reason. That's that's that that's what's keeping me mm -hmm. away from it is is the freaking length. Yeah. So like, if this is shorter, it has the potential to attract like uh, would be fans like you into um one piece mm -hmm. yes if if it's if it cuts off all the fat i would 100 percent give it a chance mm -hmm. but otherwise i'm just staying away from one piece even though i love the concept of uh superpower pirates that's what it yeah. is it, it's it is superpower pirates 